Hello everyone, this is Shadow the Impure back again after a bit of a hiatus. Things in real life have been fucking cray cray, you know how it goes. Alright, so it looks like we are going to be doing a variant seed tonight. So we might have a short run, might have a long run. I am not sure. We got some trolley flags though. We got the V2 flag indicating that we are not trying to beat Zeramus. We are trying to beat the Giant of Babel. Which means the key item in this seed is the Dark Crystal. J2K4, so key items everywhere, Japanese stuff's turned on, we got P2, C3, which means we're only going to have five unique characters, of which Yang is one of them. And then we got uh, S4B2, F2, N2, E3, uh, X2, Cash2, Y2, W2, and Z, which doesn't mean a whole lot, but we got uh, some interesting flags. We're going to have to work for it, though, a little bit, but we do have Glitchless turned off just in case we don't get a healer. I know I've been a little bit exploity with the apples lately. I promise if I find the apples, I will use no more than like 30 of them total. And I'll try to avoid buying the apples. So let's get this started in 3, 2, 1, let's jam. Alright, so we're starting with Yang. And we're also going to have a... Fusoya. Alright, and we're getting a Karate Gi. Alright, not exactly useful, but whatever. Start in bear and see what we can find here. Nothing of any value. All right, see what's in here. We've got a palum. So that's good to know. We're going to have a palum. So it's already starting to look like a pretty mage-heavy seed here. That could be for good or for ill, I'm afraid. Because a mage-heavy seed can either be great or it can suck. Uh, what you want to be heavy on is white magic, so... A, ro a, ro uh, a Rosa, a Porum, and a Fasoya in a party are, you know, fucking fantastic. You've got heals for days. Which basically means in the final fight you can pretty much hold down the A button and win. Oh, get out of my way, you fuckers. Alright, since we've got a Fasoya and a level 2 Fasoya challenge, we're going to want to start taking down some fucking bosses pretty quickly here. I'm going to clear Baron and Mist. Let's see what's in here. Mm, nothing really all that interesting. Nothing all that interesting there either. Diadrum. Very useful if you run into uh, Calbrina early enough in the game. Because the Earth Drum pretty much just wrecks their face. Another Moon Veil, Crystal Ring, a Charm. Alright, so I can at least outfit Young pretty well. Alright, there's some defense for you. Remember, we are hunting for the Dark Crystal. All right, let's see what's over here. <coughs> let's see. And it's Evil Wall. 
Wow, your spells suck, Vasoya. Oh, your spell sucks so bad, Vasoya. Alright, then hit it with your stick. Nail it with a Boreas. That's some damage. Evil wall down. Sleep Piggy Cure 1, so at least he's got heals now. Even if they're shitty heals, shitty heals are still heals. God, I hope I find a fucking Cecil now, because I'm starting to find some decent shit for him. Stop. Watery pass. This is a no free lunch seed, so I gotta earn my characters. They're not just gonna be handed to me. A rune axe. Useful for a Sid, Cecil, or a cane. A golden apple. Now, if I just find him in treasure chests like that, of course I'm gonna fucking use them. That is the seed being being nice to me. So who am I to, you know, piss in the seed's face if it's going to be nice to me? Fuck, I ran a seed for funsies last week and I ended up getting five adamant armors without even trying. Literally, I was just uh, hunting all the loot chests and I just kept finding adamant armors. I found four and I had the pink tail to get me the fifth. Oh yeah, King Elmo is declaring fascism tonight, ladies and gentlemen. King Elmo is declaring fascism. Another Karate Gi. And then we'll get the rest of it coming through the other way. It may be time inefficient to get every chest in this cave, but I've had some of those chests that a lot of the other runners skip be some prime loot. Like a crystal sword once. I had it once be a fucking adamant armor. Once it was a stardust rod. I don't record all my seeds, y'all. Only when I can guarantee that I got maybe two or three hours of uninterrupted time. Because I never know quite how long the seeds are going to run. So I don't want to run the risk of being interrupted because I am a shitty video editor. I will freely admit that I am a shit video editor. So I really don't want to have to try my hand at fucking, you know, editing anything. If it can be avoided. Because it'll make my origin or already fairly shitty recordings even shittier. Another Dragoon Lance and some Dark Arrows. Alright, now we'll leave this place cleared out. Alright, we'll save, and then we'll go take on Octomammoth's slot. And hope it's not just something that's gonna fuck me in the ass. Because there are a fair few enemies that if you throw them with Octomammoth's base speed, you're gonna have a bad time. Wyvern. Bahamut. Just to name a few. And it is Skarmiglion, Mylon.
This fight's not too bad in this slot, especially if you've got a healer. Him spamming lit gets kind of old. Yeah, go ahead and kick them in the face. Oh, you are worthless against this guy, Fasoya. You're relegated to keeping us alive, asshole. Hey, you did a little bit of damage to the zombies. Parts tedious. I had a feeling that was going to be the case. That's the only annoying part of the fight with Mylon, is he just spams lit one over and over again. I'm just going to go ahead and mark this, because he's not got a chance in high holy hell of winning this fight. So, sorry, do we have anything better you can try? Not really. Hit him in the face with your stick. Alright, well, it looks like we're going into whole day to win mode, people. Damn, Fasoya! You scurry, boy. And you made Young look like a little bitch. <laughs> Sorry about that. As long as you keep throwing those at Fusoya, we're cool. Because Fusoya is not taking dick for damage from those. I should probably give us region. That's enough. That's enough. Quit picking on the monk. You flying box of dick cheese. Thank you. God damn it. Quit hitting young.
Oh, my body. A little bit of XP. Mute Blinklet 1. Bullshit Spells. Holy Lance. Age of Shield. It'd be nice if we can get a proper bit of DPS. Because we got equipment for days for DPS. Another Golden Apple and some cash money. I say I won't abuse apples and the seed just starts throwing apples at me. Fuck you, Seed. I thought we were friends. Right, time to raid damn Seed's treasure. Another light sword. Hey, all this redundant crap just sells, so... So I will need money for when I eventually have to go buy my sirens. I might not have to fight Zeromus, but I am reasonably certain that I'm going to need to grind at some point. Oh yeah, I've got fucking gear for days for DPS. Give me a proper DPS character who isn't bullshit young, and I can equip them. You give me mages, I got nothing for them. Alright, let's go unlock the hovercraft while we're here. Alright. Watch the dead chick disappear. Back on the boat. Alright, let's heal and save and see if we can get us a fucking character. No dupes, no whammies. No dupes, no whammies. I swear to fuck, Seed, if you give me Tella, I'm gonna be pissed. Alright, it's Palum. And Dr. Luge. him with lightning. Well, that didn't do dick, but then again, it's Palum. At low levels. I will operate him manually. Ball Nabsy. Alright, down goes the first part of the Lugi fight. And on to the second. Now we'll go with fire this time. That works! Fire! And he puts Palum to sleep. And down goes Dr. Loogie. And XP for everybody. Palom finally Palom gets some decent spells. Ice and fire too. Come on, Fasoya, get some decent spells. And Fasoya gets exit and fire too. I will fucking take that. Sorcerer garb and a room ring. Another hourglass.
Crystal Gauntlet, some cash, an exit, and an assassin dagger. Get us off this mountain. Well, I already know where there's a goddamn duplicate, and that's gonna be at the Baron Inn fight. Okay. Zeus Gauntlet. Young, you wear this instead. Boost your attack power. Another Hermes sandals. Some more cash. More cash. More cash. Dragoon armor. Another golden apple. Samurai arrows. I have a feeling that my heels in this particular run are going to be provided courtesy of Fasoya. He's not the worst healer, but he's his low MP is pretty uh, crippling. Yeah, we'll call it that. Crippling. Thankfully, I don't have to fight fucking Zeromus where I'm having to throw Cure 4s every, you know, seven or eight rounds. Alright, so what are we going to deal with in the Antlion slot? Usually, it's a fairly simple fight. Except when it's that. No oh, balls. Alright, lube up, ladies and gents. This is gonna sting a bit. Thankfully, I've got two Fire 2 equipped Black Mages, because this would suck a lot otherwise. <laughs> and Dark Knight Cecil. And there's Lit 2. Oop, and I had an alarm set that I forgot about. Ice to drain and stone. And the legend sword. More Cecil equipment. Alright, Fasoya. Get us out of here. I had forgotten I was actually going to watch a uh, cult moo Q&A tonight, but... I decided to do a recording, and I'm not about to disrupt a recording just to go uh, hang out for a Q&A with Cult Moo. If you're not familiar with Cult Moo, I'll actually link their channel in the uh, description box below if I remember to, because they're, they're, they're pretty cool dudes. Quality content. Uh, if I get an edge, I'm going to want to come back here, but that's about it. So what's in the item shop? Exits, I don't need those now. Bahamut, so if I get a Rydia, I can get Bahamut at... at Fabul. We'll get that shit after the gauntlet. Alright, so what is going to be at the in the place of the Fabul gauntlet? Alright, who's it going to be? Who's it going to be? And it's the Mega Sisters. Fasoya, use that goddamn Gaia drum now. Owie. Quake. Come on, Mindy. Mindy's not there, you bitch. Die. And that right there is why I occasionally like keeping a Gaia drum laying around. 
Armor, Cure 3, and Stop. So I've got some proper heals now. The Black Sword. Fuck you, you debilitated asshole. Ninja sword, a firebomb, a ninja hat, and a soma drop. Alright, Fasoya, you eat that. Alright, we have a lot of shit. Alright. Need to clear out my inventory before I raid the next dungeon, so time to go sell the the garbage. I've got a white spear, so I don't need those dragoon spears. I never use Insura. I don't like using bows for the most part. Alright, we'll call that good. At least get me to the next dungeon. We'll stop off in Silvera, check their shops. We're looking for sirens and anything else that might be useful. That bullshit doesn't qualify. I just got rid of you! Out of my way. There we go. Blitz whip. A Marasame. If I find an edge, it'll be nice to have gotten a free Marasame. Uh, do I want to? I think I'll hit uh, Miss Adia, uh, Miss Adia before I go to Mount Ordeals. Check the shops. Maybe get lucky. Because so if I can outfit outfit uh, Palin with a Stardust Rod. That'd make this a little bit simpler. Ask and ye shall fucking receive! What else was in here? Light Sword, Artemis Arrows, a Fire Claw. Bullshit the rest of it, but fucking Stardust Rod. I would love to give one to Fasoya. Hello, Ribbons! Too poor. Alright, sell some of this legendary bullshit. We want those. One ribbon for everybody. I'm poor now, but fuck it, we have ribbons. Status ailments aren't an issue anymore. God, I'm so glad I stopped here. Okay, no, no uh, sirens yet. Well, since we're nearby, let's go ahead and stop by in uh, a guard here. Because it's just next door.
All right, and coffins, but no sirens. Get out of my way. Strength rings, but I've already got a Zeus Gauntlet on my one DPS character. Nothing of any interest. Get out of my way. All right. Three character mount ordeals. So let's do this. I don't like to, but let's just make this happen. Just because the enemy in this slot tends to be just hard enough for three characters. Not to make the fight difficult, but just to make the fight annoying. <laughs> Thankfully, I've got Palom with a fucking Stardust Rod now, so his spells are now titties. YouTube can demonetize me all I want. I don't get enough fucking views to get money off these videos anyway. I'm just having fun. Alright, let's see what's going on up here. Three boss gauntlet. Boss number one is either the Baron End fight or the Guardsman fight. And it is the Baron End fight. Well, eat fire, motherfuckers. That's fair and fight. Fire! Finish him, Fusoya. Nope, not quite enough oomph. Um, Palum. Weak Shell and Fast. Utility spells the lot. Alright, fight number two. And it's the Baron Guardsman fight! Thankfully we have ribbons or this fight would really, really suck. Get him buffed a little bit. As I said, thank fuck we're wearing ribbons or this would be tedious. Fire! Lightning. And there goes the Baron Guardsman fight. Ice three lit two ice one. Ooh, three good spells for Fasoya. Fasoya is now a powerhouse because he's got a nice three in there. So all the early game bosses will fall before me. Alright, so what are we going to get here? The magma key, so I can go to the basement. Leviathan, hello!
Lit two. Lit two. Get smacked in the face with a wave. <laughs> one shot, one kill. Warp float and heal, which means since I've got glitchless once I do King Giot, I can warp to get the Luca the Luca Cave item. Cecil became a paladin somewhere. Tell I got spells, hopefully nowhere. God, I hope I don't find that old fucker. God, that would fuck my day right up. Right, Mount Ordeal, so you can't exit. Fuck. Alright, we'll have to trek back down the mountain. We'll go ahead, go clear the Baron in fight after this. Two relatively easy boss slots, and with Fasoya having a three, we should be able to clear them out pretty easily. Given that one of them's fucking ant lion. I don't want to start skipping ahead too far, or I might lose my place, if you know what I mean. Plus, it's two bosses and a key item slot, so... Alright, first up, Antlion. This slot has fuck all for hit points, so it's just gonna kinda die really, rather quickly. Yeah, Palum, he got Virus. Dispel Cure for in Psych, and it's three midgets in a trench coat! Virus. Ice three. And there goes three midgets in a trench coat. Slow quick quick. And bullshit. Oh well, at least I can sell it. It was bullshit, but at least I can sell it. A Baka Swan. Alright, I'm gonna head up to Troy, uh, check their shops. There's a weapon and armor and two item shops. Because if I can get some sirens, I might be able to get some good early game grinds in. Kind of cakewalk my way over the next few bosses. Get out of my way, you slow whore! Oh, fuck you! No, no love there. Check the other item shop. Oh, balls. Why do I have a feeling that those fuckers are on the moon? They're either in the moon or they're in hell somewhere. Alright. Yeah, Alright, we're headed to hell. Now nah, I'll go clear. I'll go get the lock chest in the Tower of Zot first. I'm already here at Troy. I might as well go clear the one lock chest here in the Tower of Psy. Maybe clear out another boss while I'm in the neighborhood. Ooh, a cat claw. 
gives him some speed multipliers. Speed and damage multipliers. God damn it. Oh, there's my trap chest. Fell asleep and charmed. Well done, young. A ninja costume. Right, that's the one item that's ninjas only. I knew there was one of them. I knew there was one of those set. One of the two ninja items was ninja only. I just couldn't remember which one. See what's got what we got over here. I might as well try to kill it. And maybe get a preview of who's gonna be up here. And it is Mylon Z. Oh fucker! I am so sorry. Cure four. Oh fucker! I am so sorry. Well, free XP. Looks like free XP. Yang gain two, Pollen gain two. This way I got fire three, life and cure two. We finally have a res spell. All right, give me a preview of who we've got coming so I can know if I need to find the earth. God damn it, another duplicate Palum. So far, the only other character I have found is fucking Palum. Three times now. At least if you're going to give me dupes, give me some variety of dupes. Or, you know, not make me look like a gay pedophile, one of the two. Yeah, Young's going to have to answer some rather uncomfortable questions about why him and an old man are going traipsing around with a small boy. Yeah, I don't need X-ray vision to know what the hell's going on there. Alright, time to... Do I take the risk? No, I'm not gonna go to Ablon. I just... I don't have the survivability yet. We just don't have the survivability yet. I hope nobody minds, but I'm going to fast forward through this cutscene a little bit. It's not going to affect my time because I'm using in-game time, so every bit of that fast forward was counted. But I'm just trying to save a little bit of real life time because it's kind of precious to me, you know what I mean? All right, let's see what's here in Tomra. God damn it, no sirens. 
Only two more item shops left in hell. Okay. Get out of my way. Uh, not great. Not horrible either. All right, let's go check the dwarf castle then. Item shop. Sirens! Fuck yes! And I need more money. Thankfully, I have shit to sell. Give me my sirens. There's Excalibur if I find Cecil. Give him that. That's one of my favorite ones to give to Young, actually. It does so good for his defense and for his physical attack power. Decent haul here in the Dwarf's Castle, at least as far as these are concerned. Worthless, Boreas, Silkweb. Fasoya exit us out so we can save. And we're going to try this little two boss run here. I'll stay at the end to heal my MP. There we go. I apologize. Normally I don't fast forward when I'm recording, but I'm feeling just a tiny bit impatient tonight. I hope you understand. And it's a moon boss. Please don't be plague. 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 Because plague in this slot would probably rape my face off. Because I wouldn't be able to rush damage fast enough to kill him, I think. I just don't have enough fucking people. It's Pale Dim. Oh, we can deal with you. Pale Dim. Young gain three. Pollen gain three. Learn Toad. Quake. Virus Wall. And Nuke! The next fight is probably going to be a cakewalk because we just got Nuke. Come on, come on, come on. And it's Misty! 
Unlocks an item slot up in the village mist. Give me a good one. And it's a mop. Balls. Yep, down goes Misty. Yon gain two, Palom gain two. Tosoya got lit three, Medio, and Berserk. Quality spells. Ooh, and it's the Icy Hand of Golbaz this time. Very nice, Iridescence. Alright, don't forget to warp to break the seed. Give me something good. Give me something good. Pink tail. Alright, break logic. Give me that. And it's... Well, at least I didn't have to go through the sealed cave for it. That's my logic on that front, is at least I didn't have to go through the sealed cave for that bullshit. Alright, let's heal up again. Wait, why am I doing this? There's a fucking healing pot in the basement. Because I'm retarded. I'm sorry, I haven't slept well the entire week. And it's starting to affect my performance. Probably should have thrown that illusion away because they're worthless. Unless you got a fight where there's an enemy that's physically beating the shit out of you, you really don't need it. I'm gonna head back to the surface. Now that I've got two users of Quake, we can deal with Eblin, uh, with Eblon rather. And I need to go redeem this Mist Dragon fight for this key item slot. Alright, what do you got for me, lady? What do you got? Hey, there's the Dark Crystal! We could go to the end of the game now. We would die horrifically and painfully but we can go to the end of the game I'm gonna go to the moon and see if I can get a fucking character out of it <laughs> plus with the, the very small number of key items I have this grind would suck yeah until I get some more key items this grind would suck be slow and take forever. Alright, let's head to the Crystal Palace and see what we get. Next. I would appreciate my fourth fucking character. And at least make it someone who doesn't suck. Please? Fuck you! Fuck you, you stupid whore! God damn it. Alright, well we're going back to the we're going back to Earth.
Well, it was worth a shot, at least. It didn't yield anything, but it was worth a shot. Ooh, we're in for the long haul today, ladies and gentlemen. It gave us an early dark crystal, but we don't have the, uh, the party to actually do the job. Nor do we have a sufficient number of key items to actually do our grind. I mean, we could do it on four. It would just be very, very slow and tedious. This tower is down here. Another slumber sword. That's like the fourth one this seed, I think. Monsters. Yeah, don't hit the Lamias. I'm sorry, don't hit the uh, black cats. Because they will, uh, they'll insta kill you. Use magic on them only. <laughs> like this. <laughs> Big money, no whammies. Big money, no whammies. <sighs> Fuck. Strike one. Alright, two more to go. Two more chances for something that doesn't suck before we're going to have to deal with the moon before we can actually possibly get a character. Number two, Scale Man and Skulls. Damn, young. Hey, Fusoya gained a level. Bullshit. Strike two, and... Ah, uh, right. Mad Ogres. Highly resistant to magic. Strike three, we're out. <sighs> Fuck. Means everything I'm looking for is probably on the moon. Or they're hidden in the uh, trap chests of the Fey March and the Sylph Cave. I don't know which one would suck more. 
I don't think I have float. I do have float. Okay. So that is an option. I'll probably head to the Fame Arch first. First, we need to stop by and do some heals because Fasoya tapped a lot of MP there. Ready to throw your quakes, guys. Wow, one survived. Not not two of them. And an adventure. Not what I'm looking for. You got Choco Pro. Some lights aren't a bad idea to have on me. Garbage. Hold on. Let's see who's down here. Oop. There we go. Bump my keyboard. 
Golbaz and the CPU fight. Ugh. You I can deal with. Golbaz would kind of suck. Ether. Well, you got nothing better to do this turn region. Why is Fasoya not getting a fucking turn? Alright, fix the mop. Why are you not getting a turn, you brink you wrinkled old asshole? Why is Fasoya not getting a turn? Oh, now you get a turn!
the fuck was that? One. Two. Get him up. And this fight's over. All right, we're gonna have to go for we're gonna have to go for the hail mary, and hope the wall is down. Nope. The fuck happened to Fasoya there? He just completely stopped getting turns for the better part of two or three minutes. That was bullshit. I know he's slow, but Fasoya is not that goddamn slow. I know Fasoya is slow, but I, I'm pretty sure he's not that slow. With ribbons, this fight's just boring. All they can, all they'll do is keep casting an ineffectual toad on you. Young Palum. Earth Crystal. Fucking progress. Since I'm here, I'm just gonna cl finish clearing this place out. already committed to this. Virus. Oh, don't digest Yang, you asshole.
virus. Time to go heal. Because my magic points are getting kind of low. Then we'll go finish up the other route. So we can go talk to Sheila. We have five key items. We need five more for double XP. I'll come back for it. I just want to make use of this float. And here comes the fire. Package. There's a character slot in there for me. The one thing that made this fight a legitimate threat was dealt with by my ribbons. And the tower key. Put this up at seven now. And with the tower key, we can check the tower for two slots. And maybe get the pan. I was wondering where this last encounter was. And the rat tail. All right, that puts us at eight. Two more items. Let's go cash in the package real quick for a character slot. 
probably go Cash and the Earth Crystal for two character slots as well. Alright, Cash in the package. And I get... Oh, fuck you, Tella! God damn it! Oh, fuck me running. Ugh. So you can't give me decent DPS? Are you not allowed to? Fast forward. Ugh, fucking hell. Wow, this seed does not like me at all. Oh, hi, Azura. Thank fuck you're here, because you get to die fast. Because I don't have wall. White life too fatal. Okay, I did have wall. I guess I was wrong. Oh, well. Right, let's see who's hidden behind the f fucking sand ruby wand here. Alright, there's Soma Drops. So if I need them, they're there. But with glitch list turned off, I could also just glitch Tellus MP. But still, it's fucking Tella. Give him his ribbon. Fucking worthless old man. Well, let's. I forgot to check the armor shop. Adamant armor. Okay. Soya, you're the healer. You get the Ottoman armor. I am poor now. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go cash in the Earth Crystal next. While I'm here, I'm going to raid the Trojan treasury. What is this, the secret Dragoon stockpile? Fuck's sake, that's a lot of spears. Holy lances, Gungnirs, Drain lances. That is a lot of spears.
I swear to God, if my fifth character is Deadward, I am going to be absolutely furious. My fury will know no limit. Worlds and gods will tremble before my wrath. Dupes, no whammies, no dupes, no whammies, no dupes, no whammies. Oh, fuck it, I'll take him. He's DPS, I'll take him. Aegis Shield, Holy Lance, Ribbon. Dragoon armor, Dragoon gauntlets. Alright, who are we fighting here? And it's Kai Nazo. Alright, well, let three him in the face. Down goes the turtle. Tele gained three, Young King gained eleven. Let's get the fuck up out of here before this place explodes. Give me something good. Crystal armor. I can sell it. I can go redeem next. Alright, we're just going to kind of rush through now. We've got to get the chests, though, because... We need the uh, we need these encounters for possible key item locations. Well, I didn't do shit.
it. That took way too long. Crystal ring. This is the last bunny trail I'm going to try to jump down, though. If I don't get enough key items for a fast grind after doing this, I'm just going to go for the slow grind. Simple as that. Twin Harp. There's item number nine. If I got my tenth item here, I'll be happier than a clam. And I've got two uh, key item slots coming up ahead, so... I've got a fairly good shot of getting my tenth key item. Alcabrina. Well, time to quake it to death. And down go the dolls. That is the best slot to find Calbrina in. Being in the mood to do fast forward is one of the reasons why I like using in game time. Because when you use fast forward, it makes the game clock run faster too. So it keeps you honest. There's key item number 10. I'm not even going to keep going. I'm just going to get out of here. you got for me, lad? A crystal sword. Would be nice if I had a Cecil. But I don't. Do I have any? No, I don't. There's 68,000.
stone. Ooh, it boxed that time. Alright, tell her you try. Or Yang can just kill it first. I was wondering if I was going to get through this grind without a single botched stone. Medio. A few more levels and I can get him as nuke. I'm having Nuke going into the final fight. Tala, King, Fusoya, Palum. There we go. I got the spell I was looking for. Take us to the giant. The final dungeon. We have all the tools and equipment we need. Glitch my MP going into this fight because of the auto heal. So, who are we fighting? Mom Bomb! Well, get ready to eat nuke, bitch. A lot. Nuke. 
Keep throwing those nukes. And down goes Mom Bomb. Back off and recover. Glitch tell us MP. And it's oh hi Wyvern! And he opens up by stealing a little bit of MP from everybody. Get those nukes thrown really quick. Get wall on him. Because he's going to be our bouncer. That was easy enough. <laughs> we just ran his HP down to the down to nothing within a matter of minutes. Oh. <laughs> oh. That was a good seed. We should probably get the fuck out of here before this thing explodes. All right, that was a good seed. 
All right, what is our time for the day? Giant percent. If you want my seed, there it is. So I'm just going to hold that on screen for a few seconds so you can get that seed if you want it. All right. 135.39. Not a bad IGT. We had a death in there, but that wasn't too bad. All right. As always, this has been Shadow the Imperial signing off. Have yourselves a good night. And again, King Elmo declared fascism. <laughs>